fairways at the Sunshine Golf Club in Melbourne's western suburbs are green and lush thanks to recycled water. In 2007, it was a completely different story. Severe water restrictions and a 10-year drought meant the course couldn't be irrigated. Fairway grass was brown and the ground rock hard. The first time when we took over in 2007, uh, the course was very dry. Uh, we had a limited amount of water due to the uh, sewer mining not being uh, on yet. And uh, once the sewer mining came on, we got through the hard period. Sunshine Golf Club's move to their new home gave the club an opportunity to invest in recycled water infrastructure that enabled the club to secure water supplies, irrespective of water restrictions. Sunshine Golf Club utilised sewer mining technology, one of the first in the Melbourne area. Sewer mining involves accessing raw sewage from the sewerage system and processing on-site to produce high-quality recycled water for irrigation. Wastewater is pumped from a sewer that services housing estates close to the golf club to a purpose-built treatment plant. The wastewater flows into a balance tank which regulates the amount of wastewater the plant receives. From the balance tank, the sewage flows into two aeration tanks. Air is injected to encourage bacteria to break down the solids from the wastewater. The water is then piped to the settling tanks, where the solids are separated from the water and returned to the aeration tanks. The water then passes through a sand filter. Small particles are trapped by the sand filter and removed. The ultraviolet filter disinfects the water. It's now fully treated and ready for use. The filtered and disinfected water is stored in a dam on the golf course. The treated water is pumped from the dam to irrigate the course, keeping the course green all year round. The sewer mine at the Sunshine Golf Club was completed in June 2008 and provides approximately 80 million litres of recycled water per year. The project originated when Sunshine Golf Club needed to move to its current location. It was during the drought um, at the time, so City West Water worked with the golf club to look for alternative ways to source the water. We looked at a number of options and um, soil mining was the preferred one. City West Water maintains and runs the treatment plant. Um, our operations team would visit the plant very regularly to make sure the plant runs smoothly. The project is the first soil mining plant running in metropolitan Melbourne um, and there are many benefits to it. Um, soil mining um, is independent of rainfall and um, the water is sourced, treated and used locally, so we save on a lot of power costs. Uh, sewer mining can be an option for other customers. Uh, these customers would need to be close to the source of the water, the extraction point, and also um, capital upfront costs would also be part of the consideration as well. Using the recycled water is a big bonus. We're guaranteed water supply 12 months of the year, and uh, we can use basically as much as we want when we want. Yeah, I could see uh, sewer mining being a great uh, alternative for other golf courses. Um, you get it 12 months of the year, without it you wouldn't have a golf course. The Sunshine Golf Course has pioneered the use of full-scale sewer mining in Melbourne and the benefits to the golf club have been significant. Golf club members can enjoy a well-watered green course all year round while helping to save our precious drinking water.